Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Well, let's get with this Craftsman powered screwdriver. And as you notice, it has the same nose, rubber nose, that the last one had. So, guess what? All right, let's crack this open. Here at the top, here, and there. All right, let's include the package. Instructions. Charger. Oh, it's a special charger. Can't USU, uh, USB, uh, micro USB cable. Don't lose this. Uh, and the screwdriver. I don't think it has a battery indicator, so it's probably dead. Okay. Let's see. Diagram saying how to pull the bits out. Some tape in here to keep it. Oops. Keep it in during shipping. There we go. Takes care of that. Pull the bits out like that. Okay. Little magnet on top. Let's see. Easier to go that way. Okay. And then attach it right there. Reverse. And center is light only. And in all three modes, you get the light. And bad. Let's see how this does with uh, screwing something into wood. I'm going to use the same screws I used on that I used on the last powered screwdriver I got. See if it works about the same. Let's see you. No need to clamp it down. Oops. Be better off that way. Kind of struggled. Let's see how it fares with a two by four. Oops, wrong way. bed gets the job done struggles a little struggles a little bit more than the other craftsman uh, cordless screwdriver but it'll work and let's see if it does it it looks like it does that nose right there sure it does look like it. sure it does look like it'll work has the arrow and everything. Boom. Turn. <laughs> Boom. It works.
Oops, haha, <laughs> wrong way, because the arrow says to go that way. There we go. Decent little screwdriver. We'll work with the Black & Decker attachments. They call them the compact matrix attachments. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and all that jazz.